All right, welcome everyone. We are on episode three of Harada Bitter Breath's Adventures into Skyrim. We're picking up, oh my goodness, my horse, this horse, man, Teardrop. Teardrop is definitely one of those really weird horses. <laughs> All right, let's, uh, we're gonna start off here with a level up, right? Um, so that gets our restoration to level seven and we can now officially do a full level up. So that's pretty cool, right? So it's a pretty good way to start the episode, right? With a perk point. Oh, but what are we gonna put it into? Oh, we need a bath too. I think that's what that's from. Um, we have, oh, we could put it into this. Hmm. I think we'll hold on to that for now. The other thing we could do is invest it here to get an extra 25 carry weight. But that's kind of a terrible deal. Um, lock picking, we can't do anything. Sneak, we can't do anything. We could do marksman, but I feel like we use one-handed so much more often. I think we're gonna put it, no, or we could put it into, hmm. No, we'll put it into one-handed because we really do need it there. So, this will give us a 20% uh, more damage, right? Reduction in weight penalties. We're having kind of a weird problem with our weapons. So I'm glad to see we can still take it out and everything. Um, I dropped off some stuff on the horse that we have to sell here. So we still have all this stuff. And I think what we're going to do right now is we're going to go take on the, the saber cat that we know is back over here. That jumped us unexpectedly. Let's see, anybody see a saber cat trying to kill us? Oh, so what, now it doesn't show, right? Mm-hmm, I see how it is. I definitely see how it is. Uh, while we were offline yesterday, we did discover that it looks like there's a, uh... Oh my god, it's right there, it's right there, it's right there, it's right there. Oh my goodness, see, it was right there. All right, we're gonna go for it. Did we win? Ah! Oh my god, oh, we're at freaking half health now. All right, we, uh... We're definitely running in to get some support here. Because one more hit like that and we are dead. So... Ah! Guards! Wow! They just freaking took it out in one swing. Oh, okay. Yeah, we... We're already not at full health, so... The other thing I, yeah, we can harvest these uh, chicken eggs freely, but apparently not that one. That's interesting. So we can harvest one, but not the other. So we're going to field dress this thing because we're going to take its ingredients, right? We'll uh, cancel that. Let's get, or, or make sure our healing ore is still up, right? Which, I mean, it's some free XP, right? Because every time we do something, it uh, restores us to nearly full health. So we got a couple of, uh, of items there, right? I don't think we're gonna skin the pelts or do anything else. Uh, oh, we got two large bones. Wow, that's actually really good. We can process those into bones of her scene, right? Uh, these are the stamina bones, so. Really lucky with those. Hey, look, we got a smithing level out of it too. Oh, we can do snowberry extracts too. That's pretty good. Let's see if there's anything we can learn from some of the new ingredients that we picked up. Uh, yeah, animal fat. Let's see, anything related to paralysis, we're very interested in. Yeah, the, the claws, the eyes. Oh, wow, okay, so so every single ingredient that we harvested, we, uh, we ended up learning something from. All right, so it's like 11.30 in the morning. Uh, 
Oh, I think we meant to harvest these too before we left. We did a little bit of exploring at the end of the, the last episode. And I'd like to show you something that we learned. First of all, we're gonna harvest some wood. Bring the horse back up here. Come on. Ah, uh, there we go. So, yeah, three wood. That's pretty good. Um, I think we'll drop off the fur plate and we could drop off all of our ingredients, but we we have a we have like 50 carry weight left, so we're doing reasonably okay. I'd like to show you all a neat little trick that I discovered while uh, just kind of messing around. It is a way to train. All we have to do is run back over here. And instead of pickpocketing, because she doesn't have anything, we reverse pickpocket. Now, we have a 95% chance to place this gold, and it's only like 100 gold. And so every time, and, and we also have a 95% chance to steal it too. So basically, if we go back and forth, it's like pickpocketing this back and forth, we're actually gonna get levels out of this. And I don't know if this is considered like an exploit, but I imagine that we're basically just practicing like placing gold and then removing it off of a person, right? So, and they don't know, they're an, you know, unwilling victim here. But technically it is our money, so we're not stealing anything from them. The, uh, the reason that this is so successful is because 95%, that's literally like 19 out of 20. So eventually we're gonna get caught. Hopefully we get caught while we're trying to place the money instead of taking it. But we, uh, we can use this to basically get a free level, right? Or quite a few free levels. We might be able to do this. Look, we're already at level 37 pickpocket. <laughs> and, oh, oh, okay. No more, I yield, I yield. Uh, all right, we have zero gold now. And we're, we're officially in combat, but she, here, you know what we can try doing is calming her. Victory is yours, I submit. She doesn't seem like right. fighting. No, did, did I hit her? I can't tell if I hit her or not, but. Please don't kill me. We're uh, we're gonna try and sneak our way out of here, right? She's in like flee mode. So hopefully Victory we'll be able to. I submit. No, the guards don't seem to really care all that much. So I think it's time to leave, right? We incurred a small bounty, and we're out of gold, so it costs us like 350 gold. I have to say, what, is she following us? Nope. So that's it, there we go, excellent. I'd say that was totally worth it, right? We uh, we can never go back to Windhelm, but we'll uh, <laughs> we'll continue along the path and hopefully, hopefully we won't come across anything. I never attack. No, it's still her, okay. Here, let's see if we can kind of hide here. We'll, we'll skip forward to whatever happens next. Please don't kill me. She, she's still chasing after us. Please don't kill me. This woman. Let's get the heck out of here. an eye out for enemies for oh okay that is a bear but we want the loot here so we're gonna go for it that is a really strong bear maybe we can kite this wolf into fighting it for us hey you wolf Oh, come on, come on. There we go, see? All right, 
right? That helped a little bit. All right, do not fly up into the air again. Need to be very careful about that. No! Why is it saying, that was kind of strange. It was saying that my, uh, my horse was out of stamina when I'm trying to sprint. That was really weird. Must be a bug. I do need to be careful that we don't kill our horse though. Die, you stupid bear. God, this bear's like indestructible. Ooh, but my horse is not. Horse is not indestructible. All right, we need to be careful. Yikes! Okay, these people will help us. Well, it took us that long to finally get a, uh... Oh, wait, is the bear retreating? Where'd it go? Let's chase it down. Yeah, there it is. It's running. I think. Nice. Oh. What's our horse doing here? I don't know if it'll let us let us see what the uh, what the health of our horse is, but I'm also realizing that we forgot to loot the wreck that was like back before us. That's okay. Like this, in my opinion, if we can, where where is this? Uh... Oh my god. There it is. Nice. We're not gonna take the books, but grabbing that potion was definitely worth it. Same with this, right? Like, coming in here to grab all of these things, take all the salt. Fine, whatever. <laughs> yeah, we'll take everything. We'll just take everything. Garlic? Nice. Hey, look, we finally found a saddle. That's great. Look, the uh, first saddle, right? We'll put some of these on the, uh, let's see, our boots. We have scaled boots. These are slightly, actually, they're, they're literally the same, so we'll stick with the fur gear. Anything else kicking around here, right? Eh, a couple of books. Let's see if we can't uh, pick this open. We have plenty of lock picks. That is nice. Yeah. <clears throat> Having a uh oh that was really close. Reduced level here. Very frustrating. Wow. Yeah, we'll take all that. Are we uh no, we're really close to a level up. But we wanna try and find a trainer, ideally. We're not dealing with any extra crazy fights right now. I mean, I think by, uh, we, we put a healing aura and then we skinned that. Oh my God, is that another bear? Ah! Oh, we gotta get, oh my god. I hope these guys can fight a bear. Ah. So chaotic. There's another. Uh oh, uh oh. I. Oh, there we go. We got a soldier. So chaotic. 
bears running. It has nowhere to go. <laughs> oh my god. Here, can we can we pick up this bear? No, we have to field dress it here. Let's talk to these guys. There we go. It's good to see enough. Ah, but you look tired. Come. Yeah, we'll we'll share one. All right. May your adventures find you fame and fortune. This is all just so ridiculous. Let's see if we can't pick up these wolves that we killed on the way here. Ugh. Freaking packs of wolves, man. This is why you, you bring a horse. Seriously. The ridiculousness of all this. <laughs> Ooh, all right. Looks like we've come across a, uh, a battlefield here. So we, uh, we're already over encumbered by like 200 carry weight, but you know what? We're we're just gonna take everything. Oh, oh my goodness! Oh, a spider! <laughs> it's a spider! <laughs> All right, nice job, guys. Very impressive. Extract some venom out of it. Anything on it? No. Just get rid of it for you. Oh. So we'll, we'll continue looting all these guys. Just everything. We're going to take everything. Alright. So let's... Let's take a look and see what we picked up here. Whole lot of daggers, right? Wow, we got a steel dagger of sparks here. Whole bunch of bows, so we'll be able to definitely upgrade our bow here. 140, 174 steel arrows, bunch of silver ones. That's good, we'll keep the silver. Um, let's see, Amulet of Mara, Amulet of Talos. Uh, we got some mages equipment, bunch of iron stuff, all sorts of good stuff here. I don't think we got any potions, but we have a bunch we have to sell, right? And then four wolf carcasses, a bunch of torches. It's always nice to have extra torches, right? But we probably don't need that many. Excellent. Okay. All right, let's continue south. <laughs> Oh, excellent. Looks like we've arrived at some civilization, finally. And everybody's dead. Which, you know, okay, fair enough. And guess what we're gonna take? Literally everything! <laughs> yep. If it isn't nailed down, we're gonna take it. And at this point, because we're already carrying so much, might as well just take everything. Let's see, is there any uh, any good ingredients we can take in here? No, just cabbage and some other junk. I know there is some stuff up top. So we'll wiggle our way up there. God, we have picked up so much stuff. Iron arrows, we, we can do better than that. Yep. Yep. Toral fine hair. Looks like he ain't gonna be so fine anymore. But we'll see what's in here. There we go. Uh, maybe backwards a little bit? No, no, the other way, okay. Nice. Hey, nice, got a lock picking level that. Yeah, okay, we, we are due for a level up. I was like, what the heck? All right, I don't know who we're gonna be able to sell all of our goods to, but we have a carry weight of 1,300 out of 150, so yikes. 
All right, we we have arrived. Totally uneventful. Nothing happened, right? Super chill. Super chill. Extra chill. Before I let you into Riften, you need to pay the visitors tax. Oh yeah, what's the tax what for? The privilege of entering the city. What does it matter? Hmm. You're obviously a thief. I kill thieves. I think you'd be a little smarter than that. Oh, okay, all right, fine. This is obviously a shakedown. Call it what you want. What? If you don't pay, then you're not getting in. Oh my god, we can't get in. Forget, uh, the, and because this is obviously a shakedown, but I'll pay. Nope, not even close. We don't have the gold. You want in? You need to cooperate. You know what the problem is? I know exactly what our problem is. We we smell bad. The problem is that we need a bath. We need to find a place to bathe. It seems like a silly problem, but... <clears throat> Obviously what we need to do is let them watch us bathe, and then we'll, uh, we'll be able to go right in. There we go. <laughs> Speech buffs. Okay, if this doesn't work, we're we're like totally screwed. But it should show up as a different dialogue option. If you decided to pay the visitors tax. Uh this is obviously a shakedown. All right, keep your voice down. You want everyone to hear you? I'll let you in. Just let me unlock the gate. See, we were too smelly. That's that was legitimately the problem is that we were dirty. The gate's unlocked. <laughs> Head inside when you're ready. Oh my god, that is amazing. Um, what we'll do, so we're gonna take everything off the horse here, right? Everything that we have to sell. We're gonna process these and these and these. Those. Any, uh, we have ten wolf carcasses. Oh my goodness. One of the first things that we can do here, I can see, is... Process a bone of her scene, right? So that'll reduce our weight a little bit. We have a carry weight of 1,800. So what we're gonna do is we're we're gonna waddle through town here. We're gonna find a nice place that we can uh, store all of our goods, and and then we should be doing a lot better. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nobody cares. Thieves Guild has Maven Blackbriar at her back. And, uh, I, at least I think it's over here, right? In this spooky barrel, right? Yep. Thief cash. F that's it? Four lockpicks? All right. I mean, that's a little disappointing. But we're going to take full advantage of this. So we are going to not only deposit all of our animals here, because we have way too many of them, but any items we have that are smart stolen, and this is in case we get arrested, we will be able to sell these when we are ready. So that is stolen. How many of these are stolen? Looks like three of them were. I don't think any of the rest of this is actually stolen and we can just kind of sell it. Nice. Yeah, nothing else is stolen. Great. So this is this is all of our stolen goods so far, right? And we can just kind of loot from it later. <laughs> the guards following us around. Mm. So it's 7 p.m. Let's see if we can't wiggle our way over to a shopkeep and sell a bunch of our goods. 
So we're probably gonna get, we're just gonna get smithing training, because we're gonna do a quick save. Come to see Balaman You wish to do what I do? Very well. So we're probably gonna need about 500 gold, right? Uh, I guess we'll start with all the daggers. It's all the heaviest, most ridiculous things here, right? What's the, uh, the most powerful bow we have? It looks like it's the one right at the very top there, 63, right? Nice. Yep. All right. Sell all this. The reason we did a quick save is because I want to make sure we don't go two levels up. We've been we've been doing a lot of levels. You wish to do what I do? Very well. Don't miss out. So we're gonna go up one level, and if we went up two levels, excellent. That's exactly what we were looking for. What brings you to Balaman today? Hmm. Blades, helmets. You know, so so at least we got a few needs. levels out of stuff. Oh, oh, dang it. How was that Imperial Bow? I didn't really check to see how good it was. Um, 52, yeah, it's worth selling. And he's out of gold. That's it. If you need any more smithing work, come see me again. Look at that. We're up to 2,000 gold. Holy cow. Maybe we can sell... Um, Greetings, honored. Just what you see here. Some jewelry, maybe? Here? Yeah. Anything else? Uh, yeah, I guess we'll just kind of sell all this. I think for, for now, we'll wear the Safe Amulet of Talos flight. because we don't have an amulet and we recognize that Strider. we feel more powerful despite not following Talos. Blood elixir for sale. Live you gonna buy something or just here for take a look? All right, she has 1200 gold. Nice. So we'll continue selling all of the uh, the Stormcloak stuff. Oh, there we go, okay. We can probably get training in evasion now. Come back when you're ready to spend more gold. But what I'm really interested in doing is having, I think we have to, well, I was going to have scaled gear commissioned, but we're about to go into the underground where there's a very good chance that we're gonna get like new Thieves Guild equipment. So I almost don't feel like it's appropriate for us to even bother to get new equipment like that because, you know, we're, we're going to pick up a bunch. Now we're up to 3,500 like gold just from selling to protect yourself legitimately damage. earned gear. That is incredible. Anything we can sell here? Not really. You planning on using that weapon? Nope, where's your husband? What a display of color. Where is he? The shop is still open. Where's your husband? I worked very hard. Have anything valuable? Hmm. I mean, if they're going to leave us unattended, then we might as well just start stealing stuff. I mean, that's kind of on them. In my opinion. In my professional opinion. Anything, like, valuable, though? Eh, a couple of these. One of those, one of those. Steal the elk right off the wall. Some of that. 
Excellent. All right, well... Don't leave your shop unattended while we're around. <laughs> That's what you get. To make our way back, all over encumbered. Okay, excellent. I'm trying to decide if we should rent a room or find a place down in the Ratway, which I think would be a much better way of doing it. Um, I think that's how we're gonna end the episode tonight is we're gonna clear out the Ratway. That's what we're gonna do. If you've got the coin, you've come to the right place. Pull up and we're gonna get Mercurio's help. Where is he? Who are yeah. you? Anybody seen Mercurio kicking around here? There he is. My skill in battle is unmatched. Three hundred gold. You, that skill can be bought. I think. Uh, I think we will buy it. Side, you'll have nothing to fear. Let me know if you need anything. Can I help you? Here, I have some items to trade Certainly. to you. We can see if he can use any of these. And it looks like he did. He, he at least took the uh, the hood. All right, we'll take those back. Great. Um, what did you have? Like a steel dagger? Good lord, man. And we'll give him a... Yeah, we'll give him a decent health potion, right, to use in combat. All right. Let me know if you need anything. Let's head down to the rat way. Right, what, what could possibly go wrong? I can remember how to get down to the place we're going. I think it's through here. All right, so what we're gonna do, oh nice, we got a, uh, here, we'll do a, a full save as well. We're gonna do a beef stew. We're gonna do, we probably don't need any resist magic, but we will take a, um, one of these to give us a stamina boost. We're gonna be running in with our dagger and I suppose in our offhand, we'll have a torch. We can use that to uh, burn everyone, right? Where is Mercurio? Well, we'll head in and hopefully he'll re be right next to us. A little coin always greases the wheels. There you go, Mercurio. Now we're gonna go in and we're gonna beat the crap out of everyone. I don't know. They'd skin us alive if they didn't keep doing this. Whoa, Arcurio, help! I'm on fire! What's that? Victory is your. There we go. Nice. Very nice. Some nice raw human meat and emerald. Thank goodness. And it looks like. I, I don't know if we destroyed their bow. Pretty much immediately, but uh. Alright, that is looking pretty good. Let's see, little pile of gold. What else we gotta deal with down here? Alright, jump, jump on down. You should have stayed in your ah, oh my god, she's level 20. Yeah, she just went right up to us and freaking... Huh. Can we pick this? A expert? No thanks. Here, we, uh... Use a healing aura. And maybe a potion, too. Crude potion. I don't think she had anything else, really. I mean... No, we have 3,000 gold now. Oh, oh, hold on. Traps. 
I really wish there was a different style trap for the, uh... The trigger traps like this, like a different puzzle or something. What's that? Gloves? Iron boots? think there's anything in here worth taking. Get some garlic. Here we go. Uh, oh, oh, <laughs> he just lost half his health. Did we just run over one of them too? I think we did. Yeah, he ran over here and lost half his health from his own bear trap. Like a genius. Stamina generates 50% faster gold diamond ring. Wow. An arm strike, do more damage. We'll definitely put that ring on right now. Thank you very much. Any ingredients over here? Uh, no. We can come back to that later. We got what we got. Great potion, thank you. Some wood that we don't care about. A trap that uh, hopefully, well, if, if Marcario sets it off, it won't be the end of the world. It'll be fine. Head cutters block. Anybody in here? No? I think that might have been it. I think we might have been able to clear it. I'm definitely glad that we had Marcurio's help, and and in my opinion, hey, look, lock pick or uh, pickpocketing book. In my opinion, it was definitely worth having him with us. But I don't know. That's just my opinion. Cool. We can keep him with us in case we have any other people to beat up. Although I think he's more for uh, moral support, right? make our way around and uh, what what leveling should we get do we have to actually join the thieves guild I think we do in order to get training I have no business with you oh no oh look, we can get lock picking right. training but if you get arrested don't blame it on me uh, hmm I've got your back oh my goodness that is not what I was trying to do if you're looking for conversation what other training is, is there around here sneak training Stick with me and he'll never even know you're there. Uh, how about you? you need something? No, uh, you're just a random cat. You'd better have coin to pay for your drinks. There's no handouts here. How about you? Stay out of trouble, or there's gonna no. be trouble. I thought there was one other trainer down here, but... Maybe I'm just wrong. Is it you? Beckel and me, we nope. have a thing going. Try anything with him and it'd be bad for your health. I have no business with you. Well, we'll, we'll get some lockpicking right. training because it's such but a pain in the butt. If you get arrested, don't blame it on me. So that used up like half our gold, but I still think it was worth it because we got a level up. So there we go. Put it right into health. And uh, we, got, we have two perks. Two perks to spend. So we'll stick one right in here, right? Might as well do that. The other perk, it looks like we can officially invest it into our light armor, right? Excellent. And we're a decent way. What, what level are we? We're almost level 10. We've been making really good progress. And I think that is going to be where we end the episode. We, uh, we've made a tremendous amount of progress, right? We cleared out the rat way. And so that's where we'll start off is uh, we'll, we'll work on butchering some of those animals, um, find a bed, sleep the night, and then we will attempt to join the Thieves Guild. So thank you all so much for watching. I hope you have a wonderful night. Bye, everyone.